now 644 on this Monday morning. Thanks for joining us here on Fox 10 News. I'm Sarah Wall. The lazy days of summer are here. No school bells to worry about for the next few weeks. And while we all enjoy the break from the classroom and the busy school time routine, experts say it is a good idea to keep the learning going. Studies show that our students can actually forget some of the things they learn during the school year during the summer break. That means they may come back in the fall and be behind. So, it's a good idea to put together a little summertime study plan. Doesn't have to be anything too structured, just to make sure that our students keep their brains in gear. We all know that our students lag behind a little bit in the summer, and it's called the summer learning loss. And with that, we try to encourage them to read and work on their mathematics during the summer. Because in order for them to be successful the next year, those concepts have to be retained. So it's very important for them to continue working. Many teachers in schools put together summer study guides to give you an idea of things to focus on during the summer break, like books to read, math to study. Helen says you can also look specifically at your own child. Are there some things they struggled with during the year, or are there some things they really enjoyed? Those can become the focus of your summertime learning. And make it fun. Let your little ones, or big ones as the case may be, pick out their own library books, for example. Take some educational features. Field trips. If you read a book about the beach, then take a day trip to the beach, that kind of thing. The goal is to keep our children's brains working so they don't fall behind come the beginning of the school year. And we actually have some ideas for you if you're not sure where to start at this point. Helen gave us a list of websites. They are full of ideas for summer learning. They can even help you figure out what level your kids are reading on. And all of this information is free. So lots of good stuff for you. We're going to put all of these websites on our website. So just go to fox10tv.com and look for the Monday Moms page.